Morning, beauties. So first off, I just want to say thank each and every one that is participating in this ODBJ, our different budgeting journeys, and also to the supporters, y'all. I really, really appreciate it. It has gone so great. I am really enjoying hearing these stories of these why y'all started budgeting. I mean, this is like, you know, you would think that it's all like, uh, so we can stop living paycheck to paycheck and, you know, something like that. That's like the main thing that I thought was going to come out. But y'all, when y'all listen at these stories, it's so much different stuff like peace of mind, um, uh, just to be calm. Um, also, you know, stop living paycheck to paycheck, uh, wanted to stay on the right track, futures for grandkids and kids and just. Uh, freedom budget and grow was saying uh, was talking about freedom I mean it's just so much and like you really get into these stories I mean for real um, and I just really appreciate it I really do and I really really hope that this will help someone that's trying to get into budgeting but they might just be too afraid to do it so I just really want to say just thank you so very much so now the next topic is the how so it's not how you budget, it's how you got into budgeting. So I started budgeting, I wrote this down, y'all. So I started budgeting just by looking at YouTube. I think I might have been looking at um, either trying to lose weight videos or um, what is the other one that I look at? Hauls and stuff like that, just day-to-day -day life. And I had came across the Budget Mom. Y'all, if y'all don't know who the budget mom is, please Google her. Google her. Google. I can't even talk, y'all. Google her. I probably still didn't say it right. But anyway, she was so helpful in how I started budgeting, y'all. I mean, this lady, I got to give her her props because I feel like a lot of people now budget off of her and, you know, like make products and stuff like that off of what they learned from her. So, um, and it might be somebody else different out there, but this is just who I came across first, the budget mom. I mean, she have binders, she have cash envelopes, she have savings challenges, and y'all know I love to be creative, and I feel like she is creative in her savings challenges as well, y'all. I mean, like, really check her out. If you really want to understand the world of budgeting, she is a great one to look at. And then now... Since I've been on YouTube, another it's I mean everybody is great in their own way. I'm just trying to show y'all people that uh, that I have seen or I know now. Beautifully, me and you, Salisa is really really good too. She's really good, y'all. She have a lot of stuff on her channel. From oh wow, I started watching Salisa when she was doing her weight loss journey. Um, but I mean she really. Uh, is a person that sh first of all shares her knowledge you know what I'm saying she she's I think she's like me I believe I'm a firm believer of God and I believe that what God has in store for you that is what you are going to get and nobody can take that from you you understand what I'm saying so she is a believer of sharing like she just does and you will learn so much from her channel and I'm not saying it's a lot of people on here that that um that does that but she just won that uh, really stuck out to me when I started and even now I watch her now and she's also a supporter you know she throws back the support but anyway so let me get back to the budget mom so when I first started this I was watching her stuff and she's on Facebook Instagram um, YouTube I mean just it's just she's binge worthy she really is to watch her videos and then I also remember um, and I had actually forgot about Heidi because um, I just hadn't did it in so long. But she, uh, I believe her name is Heidi. She created the debt-free charts. And I had, uh, Imani on Faith by Design had mentioned her in one of her videos. And I was like, oh my goodness, yes. I used to use her charts all the time, y'all. So she offered free charts as well as um, the ones you can pay for. And they are worth it, y'all. Especially when somebody put their time into making stuff. You know, it, it doesn't hurt you to just try to, you know, support someone, you know. But she have great stuff to look at when you are first starting off. So the Budget Mom and Debt Free Charts. I think it's just DebtFreeCharts.com. Really, really, really great people. And now, uh, and I'm not even sure, 
uh, if these women still post and stuff like that, but I know beautifully me and you does. And I, I'm probably saying Salisa, Salisa channel wrong. I always do it, but I have it across the screen. I'm so sorry, um, Salisa. But um, great, great people to watch. Okay, and then from there, once I uh, started watching The Budget Mom and Dead Free Charts, uh, I started, I went to Pinterest and Instagram, YouTube and Facebook, y'all. And it's just so much information on there to try to show you uh, how to budget and what you can use. And, and just, it's, it's just a lot of, if you just take your time, you will actually get knowledge, y'all. Because your way is not wrong. No matter how you decide to do what you're going to do, at the end, it's not wrong because that's your method. And I don't want to get into method because we're going to do that next. But then, so after I got off of Pinterest and Instagram and, you know, YouTube and Facebook, I came across Dave Ramsey. And um, I, you know, didn't really, I didn't read his books and stuff like that, but I like watched kind of like interviews that he was having and stuff like that. And I learned about the baby steps and the snowball method. Um, and I tried to do the baby steps, which I think I am, but I don't really, I kind of do them like Dave Ramsey. I believe from my understanding, he wants you to take it step by step, but I kind of like throw different steps in there as I'm doing one step, I do another one. Um, like that really helped to the uh, baby steps, which is uh, saving your $1,000 emergency fund. Y'all, I'm trying to see if I can remember three to six month. um, saving your three to six months bills um it's just a lot um i forgot y'all but anyway just search up baby steps by dave ramsey it really helped me um and his snowball method i think a lot of people do that that's taking the highest debt i think and paying that first and then going from there but then you also have the avalanche method which i don't think he did that but i know people use that method and I'm not really sure what that one is. I think it's maybe paying the smallest. I don't know, y'all. Don't let me lie. But I know it's out there, and I just wanted y'all to know that it's out there. So then I just put everything together, and I made it my own method, y'all. That's how I started to budget, learned how to budget and stuff. I just did a lot of research, which let me do my paper, y'all, because I didn't want to forget nothing to tell y'all. So I just did research, research, research. You got to do your own research. And then, and that research could be books, going to the library, YouTube, uh, Pinterest, whatever you feel like you can get information from, from budgeting, that's where you go. And then you put that knowledge with whatever you learned from your research and you just make it your own. And it's just, that's just how I did it. You just always remember to make it your own. You will not be wrong when it's your way. You can't budget by doing somebody else's way. It has to be your way because only you know what's in your family and what, you know, what y'all dynamics is and like what y'all need for you, for your family. You know, you can't go by like they say you can't do like the Joneses. You can't live like the Joneses. You have to live like your family, okay? So the takeaway, like I say, is just to do your research and just make it your own, okay? All right, y'all. So the next budgeters will be talking about their how, how they started to budget, and they will be coming up on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, y'all. Um, and I so appreciate this. Uh, y'all taking the time to watch these videos and I so I so appreciate the people that are participating okay and next week y'all I think it's gonna be the actual method because I don't want to take it too fast you know I want people to actually get it you know so they can start the year off right and you know wherever you at wherever you want to start but y'all if y'all have any questions please let me know I am not a mean person I will you can DM me you can leave it in the comments and I will be happy to help you if I can okay all right, y'all have a blessed day. And please check out the next uh, budgeters on uh, Tuesday and Wednesday for their how. All right, y'all.